I'm Ian here with Justin and Michael for the SBC Sports Talk Show. And, you know, All-Star break just coming to a close now, mid middle of the season. Let's talk about some award predictions. Start with MVP, go NL, then AL. What about you? NL MVP, I'll take the layup Shohei Otani, but my sleeper or my dark horse, Marcelo Zuna from the Braves. Um, AL, I'll go Aaron Judge. I really like what Aaron Judge is doing, and for I'll go I'll go down to Houston. I like what Jordan Alvarez is doing, and I think he will get hot this second half of the year. Cool. Well, Michael, what about you? NL then AL. Uh, I'm gonna have to agree with Shohei, who's uh, second in the home run race so far, and for N for AL, I think it's undisputed. It's Aaron Judge. He's leading the league, and almost every offensive hitting stat, you just can't stop this man. Yeah, I think for NL, got to go, for me, um, Bryce Harper. I think that the season he's having is just so underrated, and the fact that what, what he's doing in this team, how good they are, I think he's going to win NL MVP. But we do actually have some trade news now. Uh, speaking of the Phillies, actually, massive trade news going down now. White Sox, for, for I guess former White Sox center fielder Luis Robert has been traded to the Phillies for top prospect Aiden Miller, starting pitching prospect George Klassen, and shortstop prospect Starlin Cava. I mean, you've seen a Phillies team that currently has the best record in the MLB. Only, pretty much, only position they need is outfield. They need outfield offensive help. Johan Rojas not really cutting it out there. The struggles Nick Castellanos has seen. I think this is a win now move for them. And personally, I mean, I've said Bryce Harper's the MVP. I think he's the best player in baseball this year. I think they're winning the World Series with this. I mean, this I think this pushes them over the top. You know, to me, power is power. In the fall, you're going to need that power. You're going to need a baseball to cut through the cold wind of Philadelphia. You're going to need that. And Luis Robinson to the Phillies, hey, you're in a win now. As Harper said, it's it's World Series every year. You're not even going to call it World Series or bust. It's World Series every year, as he said in the All-Star game, uh, pregame coverage yesterday. Um, Luis Roberts, a great power hitter, you know, serviceable defense. But, hey, if that can finally get us over the hump, I'll take it. Yeah, I mean, especially just looking at, like, how they've lost the past two years, being up in the NLCS, being up in the World Series, going back home and losing crucial games because the offense fell asleep. You're getting a guy now that a lot of power can change a game, can change a series in an instant. Yeah, and they don't need those prospects anyways. I think it's like a free free deal pretty much because they already have, like, superstars all over the field. They got, what, six all-stars yes, last night? Eight, yeah. Eight, wow. And... They, all they need is, is this guy just for some offensive help. Yeah, well, obviously breaking news, so it's going to be a bit of a shorter show now. Kind of got all our takes in. We will hit you guys back up later with the rest of our predictions. As for now, I'm Ian with Justin and Michael signing off.